So in my last video that I made for the St. Francis Veteran Center, I basically showed you guys the location of the mansion and I also showed you guys what happens every single time when you go in. Now at the time of me recording that video, I didn't realize that I had my music turned off, but I was very much fully aware that the only used song from the story actually plays when you get close. Now for the last few days, I have been keeping track of the comments and I have been replying to a lot of you. And the number one thing that I'm seeing repeated over and over again is the Vietnam DLC. As a matter of fact, the number one comment on that video is by a user named Michelangelo and he said, it's a veteran center and the upcoming DLC contains a Vietnam mode. The two could be linked. And of course this instantly got me thinking so what i decided to do was since i'm not able to get into the house in the actual game i figured i would go into the map editor and try to find this house so i could place it down and i could just explore it on my own terms now i might be going crazy or i might just be completely blind but i was not able to find this house throughout the entire assets of far cry 5 within the map editor and this instantly started to make me think that this actually might be a DLC. If you guys remember when they were talking about the Far Cry Arcade, they said that over time they would be releasing more assets through the map editor every time that DLCs come out. So it's very possible that we don't have access to this house, the Veteran Center, because it's part of the DLC. Now of course, like I said earlier, I might be wrong and it might actually be there and I was just completely blind and I missed it. But if that is the case, please let me know in the comments. So now my next question to you guys is, is it very possible that we could have hints towards the next DLC within the story already. As a lot of you know, there also is a side mission within the game that you have to collect Vietnam lighters that are spread out throughout the entire Hope County. And I do remember one of my subscribers saying that it's very possible that this guy that made a search for these lighters could be the protagonist for the DLC. Now, the only thing that really threw me off with this whole entire theory is the fact that if we take a look at the season pass lineup, the next DLC that we could be expecting or the first DLC is the Dead Living Zombie. Now, of course, I'm not 100% sure if these are lined up in the order that they will be released but regardless i'm super curious to hear what you guys have to say about this since we found absolutely no way to get into this building does my theory sound extremely far-fetched or could it be very very possible that we are already getting hints within the game for the hours of darkness dlc regardless if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to drop a like on it and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for all types of far cry 5 wildlands and ghost war content once again thank you guys for showing so much support on all of my far cry content i will be making more of it for you guys on the channel but anyways like always i will see you guys in the next video